Do you think the hippo is a cute and harmless animal? Do you think this herbivore is not dangerous? Nothing of the kind. Hippos brutally massacre antelopes, lions, and crocodiles, chase boats with tourists, crush cars, and create other mayhem. It's worth seeing. In this episode, I'll show you hippo attacks that you shouldn't watch alone. Let's go. Antelope. Hippos are commonly thought of as herbivores that do not eat meat, but this is not entirely true. A few antelopes will show you that this notion is wrong, and hippos can safely be called half predators. This footage shows African wild dogs hunting an antelope. They try to tear it apart in a pack, but a hippo intervenes and disperses them. It would seem that everything's fine. The antelope saved. But it's stuck in the mud and the hippo won't leave it. At some point, the giant goes crazy and deals with the antelope in a couple of bites. Now the dogs don't have to make any effort. Here's a similar case. The antelope's stuck in the mud again, and a hippo comes after it. Or rather, two hippos at once. The giant attacked it, and it had no chance of survival. Okay, you can write it off as a hippopotamus's mental confusion. But then, what's this? Here, the giant is purposefully hunting an antelope and doesn't want to give it to the wild dogs. It chases it into the pond and bites it periodically. Not much at first, but soon it inflicts the final bite, and the prey is defeated. And here we see a hippo eating an antelope. After a quick attack, it bites and pushes the carcass to the shore where it begins its meal. But again, it's interrupted by the ubiquitous wild dogs. They steal the hippo's prey and make it angry. At first, it continues to eat and tries to ignore the strangers, but soon decides to disperse them. At this point, it loses its prey, and now it'll have to win it back from the pack of hungry dogs. Attack. It's hard to imagine how the antelopes who were attacked by the hippos felt. But the people in the following video know exactly how it felt. The hippo's in a small enclosure in a pit. As it bites on some stick, it's controlled. But suddenly, the giant rages and gets out of the hole. It attacks the humans, and they're miraculously saved from the terrifying jaws. Only a few inches separate them from certain death. Soon it was repeated. The hippo came out of the pit again and tried to eat the people. I tell you, they have some really extreme entertainment. I would stay away from hippos, any hippos at all, and especially from hippos like this one. Look at his back. The giant had recently been in a fight and must have lost. It was wounded. Even a healthy hippo is extremely dangerous, and a wounded one, even more so. But the tourists are sitting in a car several feet away from it. This is not going to end well. The hippo starts moving its mouth and attacks. The tourists manage to accelerate, but the hippo still hits the car. At least it didn't hurt anyone. Crocodile. The hell? Ask the crocodile in this video. It survived it. Whether by stupidity or accident, it wandered into a body of water that was literally teeming with hippos. Dozens of huge individuals were resting in it when the reptile visited them. Getting into the hippo pond was almost a guaranteed death sentence. The giants began to toss the crocodile, trample it, bite it, crush it, and so on. They did whatever they wanted to. Only by some miracle did the crocodile manage to survive this onslaught, break free, and escape. If you happen to be traveling to Africa by car and encounter a hippo on the road, do not stop under any circumstances. Otherwise, something like this will happen. The hippo saw the tourist and decided not to hesitate. It speeded up and rammed the car with all its might, and then bit the bumper a little. One can say the driver was in a real traffic accident. Just look at the damage that was done by the hippo. But it's not surprising, considering that these animals weigh as much as cars. Lions. So, I gave you some advice, and now I'm giving it to the lions. Well, in case the kings of the jungle are also watching our channel. So, lions never wake up sleeping hippos. See how that turned out for one of the wild cats. Hey, hey, wake up. The lioness woke up the hippo, which immediately went on the offensive and bit its head. It was a miracle that the lioness managed to escape and survive. A little more and the hippo would have crushed its head as easily as a pumpkin. And here, the hippo is already sorting things out with the males. They got into its pond, and the giant decided to kick them out. It attacked one of the predators and began biting it and pushing it towards the shore. The lion's agility and speed saved it. It was one wrong move away from death. The second lion understood everything and also got out of the water very quickly.
kayak. It's great to go kayaking. You're close to the water. You can control the transport yourself. You can see the plants and animals in detail. All in all, there are a lot of benefits, but not when you're kayaking down an African river. First, there are crocodiles. And second, hippos. Here's one of them. The giant jumped out right in front of the tourist kayak and attacked him. He was incredibly lucky that the kayak didn't turn over. Otherwise, the same thing would have happened to him that happened to the antelopes from the beginning of the episode. In general, that hippo was somehow kind. He didn't even continue its attack. Usually, these giants act like this individual. The hippo saw the strangers on a boat in its pond and immediately chased them at full speed. In water, hippos can swim at speeds of up to 9 miles per hour. It's incredible given the animal's size, isn't it? Although it's fast, no hippo can catch up with a motorboat, so the tourists were safe. Hippos are truly dangerous animals, and you've seen that. Nevertheless, even after all this footage, many people may continue to think of them as rather cute creatures. Fatness of these creatures clouds the mind. In addition to hippos, there are other animals in the world that are harmless only on the outside, but in fact can give a serious fight or even injure and send a person to kingdom come. Let's take a look at them. Panda Let's start with these cute, chubby creatures. It's very hard to be scared of pandas. They're clumsy, soft, and very cute. It seems like all they do is eat bamboo and sleep, and in fact, it's true. But many people somehow forget that pandas are predatory bears. Sure, they're not as dangerous as polar bears or grizzly bears, but it's better to stay away from them. This guy clearly underestimated the panda. He defiantly sat right next to the cage with his back to the beast. The panda didn't like that attitude very much. It attacked him and started hitting his back. After that, the panda switched to the guy's jacket. It stole it, and the guy himself was practically unharmed. And this girl did a stupid thing at all. She put her hand right into the panda enclosure. The female panda attacked her sharply and clung to her. The girl screams in pain, and only a concerted effort helps her. She was injured, but survived. Swan Swans are not easy creatures either. On the one hand, they're very graceful and beautiful. We associate them with grace and tenderness. But behind all this beauty, there is a real nature of the swan. This bird can be very dangerous. For example, here, a swan attacked a golfer for no reason. At first, he even laughed. But then the swan began to bite and pinch him. And it wasn't funny for the golfer already. He had to flee. By the way, swans often attack golfers, so keep that in mind if you're out golfing. This swan attacked a passerby. Apparently, he had strayed into its territory. The angry bird spread its wings and forced the man off the path. And when the man stomped back, the swan tried to attack him with its wing. Well, and this swan doesn't like wakeboarding, so it pushed the athlete off the board in one move. In addition, swans can clash with animals, including pets. Check out this swan attacking a dog. And by the way, check out the size of the bird. Swans are truly enormous. Their size and aggression are enough to cause unpleasant injuries. It's best to stay away from them. Koala Even though koalas are not bears, they are often compared to them. Seriously, they're just miniature cute bears that won't lay a finger on anyone, right? Of course not. Koalas are more dangerous than most people think. The koala boasts not only a cute appearance, but also long claws, powerful jaws, and sharp fangs. And their character is not simple at all. They often attack tourists. See for yourself. <laughs> this koala attacked a girl on the road. She came out to help it, but apparently she didn't know that koalas can snap at people. The animal even knocked the girl down. And this koala attacked the child and bit him. The parents had to spend a lot of time to tear the aggressor away from the child. In addition, koalas put up fights with each other. And no, they're not limited to lazy fighting. Koalas fight very hard, using both active wrestling and their stand-up skills. By the way, many koalas are carriers of chlamydia, so if an animal attacks a human, it can infect them with chlamydia infection, a very unpleasant disease. Still think they're just cute miniature bears? Look at this cutie. It smiles so cool and sleeps so sweet. 
what can such a cute and amazing creature do in the first place? Well, for example, finish off a seal, eat some penguins, and even drown a human. This is the leopard seal, and it can be safely called the most dangerous predator of Antarctica along with orcas. This is one of the most aggressive seals on the planet. Yes, it's really cute in appearance, but in fact, it's a real killer. The leopard seal is very aggressive in hunting penguins, they can't hide from it, and it's very ruthless with them, as well as with other animals of Antarctica. People can also get it. Away from the water, the leopard seal is not dangerous, but if a human is sitting in a boat, the predator can either bite the boat or even grab a human and drown them. Unfortunately, this has already happened. In 2003, scientist Christy Brown became a victim of a leopard seal when the predator grabbed her and dragged her down to a depth of 230 feet. That's all, guys. Which moment featuring the dangerous animals surprised you the most? Let me know in the comments. Thank you for watching, and see you later.